Well, recruiting is essential for the Tar Heels, and it turns out you have to have some green in order to wear Carolina blue. Reporter Janelle Davis takes a deeper look into the world of recruiting for the UNC women's soccer team. National championships. The UNC women's soccer team has won more than twice as many as all other schools combined. The program is known for its unmatched success, but it didn't start here. Or even here. It starts here. Being the best requires having the best. So recruiting is essential for the Tar Heels. There's no sort of magic elixir uh, that you can have your players drink before the game that's going to transform them from average players to great players. You've got to have your share of great players. With so many players vying for position on Coach Anson Dorrance's roster, the real challenge for aspiring Tar Heels is setting themselves apart. Youth soccer coach Rusty Scarborough believes he knows what it takes. A lot of time. A lot of time and commitment and hard work. Um, you know, obviously it, it costs to play soccer at the youth level. UNC's recruiting coordinator, Chris Dukar, agrees. What the players and parents have to go through now is incredibly expensive. The travel, uh, the, to pay for the professional coaching, to put them in a position to be recruited by us, uh, it's tens of thousands of dollars a year. For elite soccer players, soccer during their junior year of high school costs roughly $7,600 for travel teams, including uniforms and private training, $6,750 for tournament fees and travel, and $2,650 for college camps and recruiting tapes, which adds up to $17,000 in the year that recruiting is at its peak. But parents we talked with estimate the entire recruiting process could ultimately cost a family about $70,000. Which raises a question, is a possible spot on a college roster worth that expense? One of UNC's 14 soccer scholarships can be worth up to $77,000 for in-state players, barely covering the family's investment, and $165,000 for out-of-state athletes, more than doubling the money spent from ages 12 to 18. The reward isn't just monetary, though. We want to play for UNC. I want to be a Tar Heel. I want to be a Tar Heel. Current Tar Heel national team player Crystal Dunn was once just like these girls. We have so many great players that come in and out of this program, and I think for me, just personally, um, you know, I wanted to play on the same field that the great players were playing on. So if young players want a chance to be in the rain of confetti, their parents should be prepared to make it rain cash. In Chapel Hill, I'm Janelle Davis. This year, UNC picked up only one top 25 recruit. She's at number 10, according to Top Drawer Soccer.